Hey YouTube, I just wanted to uh, take a second and show you the new board that I've set up. Um, so, uh, here it is. Let me flip the camera. Will it flip while I'm filming? No. Alright, back to it. So, this is my board that I just got finished pressing and pulled it out of the press today. Um, it is a three-ply maple board with seven layers of carbon all pressed at one time with epoxy and I threw a little graphics on the bottom those are not gonna last because I just made some sort of sticker like material that doesn't stick very well and just put it on there so that'll be that'll come off on my first board slide but until then I threw it on there but it's carbon fiber, it has seven layers. I broke my other board like, or I actually I thought I broke my other board that was like this. Um, but actually, I had pressed it in two different sections. I pressed some, put some more carbon fiber on it, uh, extra layers. And the layer, two layers came apart and it just felt like my board was broken because it kept on flexing at the tower really hard. But once I inspected it, I couldn't find where it was broken. It's just flexing a lot. so. Maybe I could actually repair that and maybe give it out or something. Uh, but this one, I press all into one piece and I also uh, heat cured it after I left it in the press for uh, 40 hours. And so anyway, it is a 9 inch board, just slightly under 9 inches. Um, and it's 33 inches long. It's a wheel base of 14.75. I pressed and made this mold to press this completely myself and made the press. These wheels are the smallest Powell G slides that they have. They're pretty soft wheels and but they don't really slide that well especially for like ledges and stuff so I have to use wax or change everything and I'm using some Venture trucks. These are eight uh, I think these are 875s, so they're a little bit, or maybe they're even 8.5s, or maybe they're a little, uh, they're a little too small for the deck, but that's okay. I don't mind. Mm -hmm. And I could have cut the deck probably smaller and even had a thinner board, I guess, but I like this size. And I'm using some non abrasive grip tape made by 3M, and, uh, it, uh, uh, it's something uh, I was trying out on the last board, and I think it helped pull the layer off uh, where I, I tried to epoxy two carbon fiber layers together at different times. But anyway, um, hope you enjoyed seeing my setup. Oh, also, I've got, uh, I think these are the Bronson bearings in there. I use reds and Bronsons, but I think these are Bronsons. No? Actually, these are reds, and I have some Bronson Bronson's and some slick wheels that I have if in case I have to change out for ledges and stuff if I go to a park But anyway I um, hope you enjoyed seeing my board and you'll get to see me use it here Before too long or at least uh, w when you catch up to the footage because I'm a lot of episodes ahead But anyway, hope you enjoyed it and I will see you next time